You gotta be shitting me. Yo, and they even have like characters who can like First, creatures who can transform too. Try. Then Damn, yo. My tavern. Damn. <laughs> What is up guys? It's Leviathan and we're back with another reaction today. Today we are starting a brand new series, The Legend of Vox Machina. And man, oh man, I've been excited to record this one, honestly. I've had a lot on my plate um, over the last couple of weeks, so I hadn't had a chance to kind of uh, record this one. But I'm excited to get this started, honestly. From the trailer, from what I could tell, you know, it's a, it's a show with action, adventure, comedy. And, you know, it's animated, which means, you know, <laughs> it's going to it's gonna be, look really, really, really good. <laughs> I'm excited to watch it, honestly. I didn't see anything more about it, uh, about plot-wise and everything. So definitely going to be surprised for what we see here so I'm definitely excited to get started with that so let's just jump right in um, don't forget to like share and subscribe turn on notifications down below so you know when I upload next and also make sure you check out the patreon link as well you know you get full uncut reactions of this show many other things such as movies anime other TV shows honestly check it out I appreciate all the support that comes on there but with that though, we're just gonna get started with the first episode of Vox Machina, The Legend of Tal Doray. Let's go. Also, one little tidbit before I get started. So this episode is called The Legend of Tal Doray Part 1. So the next episode will be part two. Long ago, in another realm, stood the majestic kingdom of Tal Doray. Once the battlefield of gods and titans. Ah, so the location is called Taldere. Wow, I didn't realize we were going to learn that within like the first 10 seconds of the series. A brave group of heroes banded together, ready to face this evil. Hold fast! The beast approaches! Uh, Yo, that guy! <laughs> you what? Shall pay for what? <laughs> Humanity will never fall to you. Yo, they're all just getting like yeeted. All of our mercenaries <laughs> slaughtered like lambs. I state my case again, Sovereign Uriel. Send our army to challenge whatever this fiend is before it decimates the entire kingdom. I will not send our remaining <laughs> army beyond the city walls until we know who or what our enemy is. We must find more mercenaries. And where, might I ask? The Torian butchers are butchered. The murder hobos murdered. The death dealers are all dead. The death dealers are all dead, man. <laughs> That's right. Who's the best? Yeah! Grog ah! wins. Again. <laughs> oh, fuck me. Why do we always play drinking games with a guy twice our size? Because it's the fastest way to get drunk, obviously. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, <Yum>. obviously. <laughs> oh, watch it, bitch. Hey, you watch it, dick nose. Easy, Grog. We don't waste our time on talking assholes, remember? Well, this fuck some muck, you know. What a fucking joke. <laughs> Let's keep things civil, friend. Look at your scrawny ass. Too weak to tickle your own pickle. Are you offering to help? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, no, I... Fuck you! Oh, I'm only asking you to give me a hand. <laughs> Could you imagine if somebody was too weak to tickle their own pickle? <laughs> You nasty. Why does this happen every time we go out drinking? Oh, Where the hell is Scanlan? La da da, la da da. My lady's rose, I will okay. pluck. I did not expect any nudity in the show either, but you know what, man? I don't sight. care. You gotta be shitting me. Yo, and they even have like. Characters who can, like, First, creatures who can transform too? To dry. Then Damn, yo. My tavern. Damn. Vox Machina will find those responses. Don't even try it. Manny, now. 
Emmanuel, I, I like how she tried. I like how she tried to finesse that and make it and blame somebody else when they were clearly the ones who caused all that damage. Wonderful. We got no money, no place to live, and fuck all for prospects. Well, perhaps if someone didn't accidentally decapitate the last fellow who hired us. I apologize, didn't I? Have you guys ever thought maybe we're not really meant to do this? I mean. Vex and Vax only care about themselves. Oh, oh fuck, fuck you. you. <laughs> Grog just wants to murder everyone. Yeah, pretty much. Percy barely wants to be seen with us in public, and Scanlan wants... To bed everyone in the realm. Yes, you can say it, Keyleth. I'm not ashamed. <sighs> Honestly, why are we even together? Hmm? Oh, uh, oh uh, apologies. <laughs> it has a mind of its own sometimes. What's the matter with you? Come on. <laughs> this guy just pissed on his leg, this, man. <laughs> this is our purpose. Yo, the Scanlan guy is already justice, my favorite character. The glory, protecting the kingdom and stuff. Okay, we'll take you in, but the bear waits outside. Oh man, why are you guys dissing the bear like that, man? Yo, like, yo, this is some bear racism right here, man. Bearism. Send another guardsman straight away. <laughs> These guys didn't even like clean themselves sorry, up. They came here like, from the tavern market. all dirty, you dirty see, and actually ra ragged to the king's Honestly, court. Honestly, don't Craig, don't bother with these drunken buffoons. Guards? <laughs> buffoons? Clearly, you've never heard of the legend of Vox Machina. There's Grog a mighty giant, he's a simple-minded hulk And Percy's pepper box can blow apart your fucking skull Pike's divinity is pure, her hands can always heal Oh, and did I mention we have a bear? Drink it, no big deal And as for myself, my name is Scanlan The man with the fat purple hand what? The legend of Vox Machina Oh, thank you very much more than meets the eye with these warriors. Eh? Uh? Nah. Yeah, <laughs> doubt it. Very well. You're hired, Box Machina. Yo, what's up with Maybe that one guy in the front, bro? Because he Lady looked kind of suspicious as she looked at him, steps. you know? We don't know what you're killing, but once you kill it, all this is yours. Uh, one more question? Yeah, how are we supposed to get there? Money, money, money. That, that, that's the only thing that I need, man. Brother, I am telling you, I felt it. Right there in the throne room. I haven't felt that since. Isn't this ship amazing? There's two bathrooms downstairs. Hey, by the way, why are you both whispering like we can't hear you? Can you mind your business for once, gnome? Me, 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 me. Yeah, yeah, nobility <laughs> and heroism is fine and all, but we're in this for the money. I see. So it's coin over character. Not surprising. The shale steps are beyond that hill. Good luck. Please don't uh, <laughs> fuck this up, as they say. Thanks for as the they ride. say, naturally. You'll be back to pick us up later, right? <laughs> You're a priest of sorts, aren't you? Could you bless our house? Protect uh, it from this evil. Uh, a blessing? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sure. Uh, no problem. Wait. Okay. She, she's a priest. She doesn't even. She doesn't even look like a priest. Wow. Are you a wizard? <laughs> nah. Bro, the magic these, these in people the in the skin. village are like impressed by the smallest things, ah. man. Something flew right over us. It knocked down the big tree on the hill. We heard wings beating, but we couldn't see it in the storm. But it was big, really big. Yeah. Yo, are these guys hunting a damn dragon? For the love of God, bro, these guys, I, I, I don't know if they can, if they're up to the task, man. I don't know. I'm, I'm surprised they're really taking this mission real seriously, though, man. The whole tone just shifted really quickly from very funny to very serious and, and uh, action-y. <laughs> Get the fuck out! What a little <laughs> lamb was behind all the mayhem! You clearly that wasn't the, the lamb wasn't the problem here, bro. It was the giant dragon here who was eating the lambs. <laughs> 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 he 
even worse too, it's an elemental lightning dragon, man. So it's, it's shooting out lightning and fire at the same time. I suggest we run right now. Fuck that. We fight. Exactly, man. Screw that shit, man. Yo, we fight. They don't seem to be completely helpless, you know. At least, at least they got some skills, you know. And they, and they clearly, most of them clearly know how to use magic. You guys, you guys saw that thing shooting out lightning. You just literally healed it up. <laughs> Yo, this Kalif lady. She's powerful, but I think she's stupid. <laughs> oh, get me out! Get, get me out! I'm trapped under Grog's ass! So. Dragon, we almost died. Uh, Except we didn't die. Because of you, Keyleth, you hear me? We're alive because of you. Question. This is normal. Oh, no. Bro, Grog's like, yo, he's Hold bleeding still, out, friend. man. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> this guy's like just a flesh rune. <laughs> Gushing out blood. <laughs> oh, I feel better already. Yeah, I guess you could say RPG positions, right, you know what I mean? Uriel and all of this. We're done here. Because, like, uh, sign up Grog here's like death. the berserker, Must at least. I remind and, like, you, the pike girl's like the, the healer. Council. We fought a lot of things, but a dragon? An actual dragon? It's not about the council or the contract. It's about these people. Yo, man. They need yo. Us. I'm I, I, I like this. Young, I like this. One of those monsters killed our mother. I've studied dragons my entire life, hoping to find the one that did it. I can feel when they're close. Felt it there too, at the palace. Wait, you're just telling us this now? I'm sorry. There I, was a dragon at the palace I wasn't or something? Until the dragon because that doesn't make any sense, right? Mother. Are you sure of exile? Because she felt she it. felt the dragon or Someone something. Someone on the council must have been in contact with the dragon. Or... Oh, there we go. Let's just get the hell out of here and never set foot in a mon again. Can we all agree on that? I understand their point of view, though. That thing killed their mother, so I I can understand why they would be scared of that dragon and want to walk away from this. Something oh, no. tells me that they're not they're gonna have to be forced into oh, doing no. this. Yo bro, that's that's harsh man. That's harsh. They were literally seeing these people alive just like an hour ago or two hours ago. Pike! Get over here! Please, Everlight, let your power reach him. Oh no, man, that's that's harsh, man. Imagine, imagine having somebody who has healing powers but is unable to this. heal the unable to heal the person. Shoot. Shit. I guess we're killing one. I'm in. Oh, I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I'm. Terrified out of they needed that. But I'm in. They definitely I needed that. Like that was that was the boost they needed. Now I'm feeling things on the inside. They don't feel right. So yeah, I'm with you. You all realize we're going to die a truly horrible death. Perhaps, sister. But we'll die gloriously, and we'll kill a fucking dragon. Let's go, Vox Machina! Let's go, man. Let's go! That was such a good... Okay, alright. That was that was such a good first episode, guys. That was such a good first episode. The Legend of Vox Machina. Already? Already already up there for me. Quick recap of what I, what I like about this show already is... Um, you know what? I'm loving the group, the party, with the characters that they had over here. You know, their names are actually super easy to remember, man. Vex and Vax, Pike, Grog, Percy, um, Halith, and um, Scanlan. 
that's Vox Machina, and I'm and I'm appreciative that they that they made the name super super um, complex and different so that you could remember it very easily. Cause that was the one thing I was a little bit worried about with it, cause there was a bunch of main characters. But you know what? We good. We good. Story wise, love it already. Um, I think I think there's a um, bigger underlying mystery that they wanted to kind of set up with us with that whole dragon thing and whatnot. But it was really great meeting Vox Machina. You know, I like the fact that they they were a ragtag group that wasn't very um was well known but not for the for good reasons but for bad reasons I guess you can say and weren't really trusted with a job like this so to see them being trusted with a job like this and them accepting it was really really great to see halfway through that you know kind of seeing them kind of approach the dragon's lair and things like that I was I was really impressed to see like the kind of the way that they fight and things like that and how they work as a group and and, and stuff so you can really tell that they've been together for a while as well so there's going to be a lot of good good adventures that come come forward going going ahead but um we're still on this whole dragon thing so i can't wait till we get to the part two of, of this episode but anyway um yeah i think that's it for this video over here good quick recap for that episode definitely excited to get uh get started on the next one so just gonna jump real quick into that um i will see you guys around again thank you guys all for the support that you give me it's greatly appreciative I, i'm loving it and it keeps pushing me to keep doing these videos anyway see you around Bye.